Hello everybody, I want to show you with this video how you can transfer data from the internal storage to the micro SD card at the Samsung Galaxy M51. So for that we will need the pre-installed file explorer. So just scroll up like this and here at the Samsung folder we have an app named My Files. So if we tap it, we have at first a nice overview here for the images, videos, audios and so on. But we will need now uh, at first here the internal storage. So here you see all the stuff which one is on your internal storage. And uh, let's start to transfer something. Uh, if you are looking for the pictures of the camera, which one takes a lot of uh, memory, uh, then let's go here to the DCIM folder. And we will find it here at the camera folder again after. And here you will see all the pictures you have done with your camera. Okay, now let's mark the pictures we want to transfer. So hold one picture here. And we have here now the opportunity to select the pictures we want to transfer later. And if there are many pictures like at me now, just go here on all and you have selected them all. Okay, now we have here this bar uh, and we are able to move them uh, or to copy them. If you copy them, you will leave a copy for the safety on your internal storage. But I would recommend to you to move them because we want to have more space on the internal storage. So let's go on move. And now go here on the folder with the uh, little house. And you're back here in the, in the main uh, settings. So then go here to the SD card. So now we are on the SD card. Ne? Um, I have already here some folders on my SD card because I have used it um, already. Um, and I would recommend to you if you are starting now and you have no folder on that SD card that you create at first the DCIM folder. So just go here on the three points and go on create folder and then you can create a new folder or name a picture or something like this so that you have a better overview here on your SD card. Okay, but as you can see, I have already here an uh, existing DCIM folder, just go here, go on camera. So now in, if you're on the folder, you want to have your pictures, or where you want to have your pictures, then go here on move here. Okay, and now the phone is transferring the pictures from the internal storage to the micro SD card and exactly the folder you have selected. And uh, yeah, I have many pictures here that takes a while. So, <laughs> and two, I selected too many, so I will forward the video now. Okay, I'm almost ready now. So uh, this has been, uh, everything has moved now to the SD card. And uh, yeah, you can do the same thing with folders, by the way. Let me go back here uh, with the, on the folder with the house to go back to the main uh, menu here of the uh, File Explorer. Then let's go back to the internal storage. And now we are back on the internal storage with all the folders on the internal storage. So you can move also folders if you just hold them like we have seen in the pictures. And now I have marked a complete DCIM folder. And then I can select the download folder as well, and so on and so on, and the movie folder. But please take care that you just take um, folders which one contains only music, documents, pictures, videos, and so on. Uh, but don't take, pic uh, don't take folders with operating system data because it could damage your phone. Okay, and after the same thing, go and move. Or copy as you want i would recommend to you to move it and then yeah that's it okay then i want to show you something else because uh, uh, for your future pictures you can select the sd card directly so that your pictures you should go directly to goes directly to your sd card let me show you what i mean so just go here on the camera and the main case you have uh, inserted this, uh, the, uh, the sd card is asking you immediately if you want to uh, change the um, change it to the SD card, but if not, go here on the settings, then scroll down to the point storage location, and here you can choose between the internal storage and the SD card. I would recommend to you to go on the SD card because then all your future pictures go directly on the SD card, so you save time, you don't have to move always the pictures uh, again and again. So that goes automatically there. Yeah, 
Thank you so, so much for watching this video, A Little Fly. I hope I could uh, help you with this and answer your question. And yeah, maybe if you want, you can leave me a nice comment or give me some thought that would be very helpful for my videos. Uh, thank you so, so much for And you have created also some other videos if you're interested in me, Just subscribe me. It would be really a pleasure to see you again. And yeah, maybe until next time. Ciao.